Well, here we have the new Herbie. This is uh, our 29er cross country frame. Designed around a boost rear axle, so 148 rear spacing. Uh, designed to be long and low and fast, so internal cable routing. Um, for this frame, it's actually got ports, little removable ports, but it, the production frame, this is mine, the production frame will have guided, so there'll be a tube inside. This one hasn't, but the production frames will be guided inside. Um, this also has rack mounts, uh, which... Um, is optional because I, when I first designed this it was designed for cross-country so I wasn't going to put any mounts uh, just the bare bare necessities but the more I thought about it I thought well if I'm going to have this and keep it and use it then I might as well have everything so it's got rack mounts on the back I say internal routing completely internal except for where the seat post is um, it has dropper internal routing although I'm probably not going to run a dropper 73 uh, mil threaded bottom bracket extra mounts on the outside of the down tube and two on the inside so just in case um, head tube engraved with the new logo smokestone logo uh, the headset again is is 42 is 52 all of our frames have this setup all the titanium frames so bearing sits in the frame top and bottom makes it very very easy to service and fit no tools required uh, seat post size is 31.6 which again is the same as all of our titanium frames. Um, rear, so what's I going to say? The rear chain stays fixed, no, fixed dropouts with UDH gear hanger, so uh, universal drill hanger, so you can run um, ASX SRAM wireless gearing if you want. That's about it. Frames say is in uh, titanium. I will be publishing all the weights and the geometries on the website already. If you wish to buy one there, £1,550 for the frame only. Um, or it does it does come with a seat clamp. I know that's not a lot, but it does come with one. Um, complete bike prices will be available shortly. I'm just about to build this up, so look out for the build video. Okay. Let's get this show on the road. Let's get and build this bike. When you're fitting, um, I've just fitted the bottom bracket, as you've seen. I'll always put grease on the threads of a bottom bracket. Um, you do not want it to pick up. You don't want it to bind. It could be anything in the thread. And you just put a bit of lube, a bit of grease in there, and just make sure it doesn't stick. Um, with Hope Cranks, obviously I'm, this is all Hope stuff, um, you've got to put plenty of grease on everything. So you put grease on the splines, grease inside, uh, grease on, on the axle itself as you put it into the bottom bracket. Um, hope supply tools to fit their bottom bracket and also to put on the chain ring it comes with the crank you get a tool to come with the crank uh, grease wise I always use um, TF2 all-purpose it's got a bit of Teflon in it I've used it for a long time and it works I tend to use a tube I don't like using a pot you see a lot of people online with a pot of grease with a brush and you obviously they use the brush they put on the grease and they put the brush back in the pot so if there's any grit, it goes in the grease. Uh, not a good idea. Always keep your grease separate. Put the lid on it. Keep it clean. Because you do not want gritty grease going into your bearings, into your into your parts. I don't know quite why they do it. I guess it's just it looks cool on a camera. But I always tend to use clean grease. Don't put a pot 
put whatever it is, even your finger, don't put it back into a tub of grease because you're just transferring grit and grime in there. Just a little tip. See how we look. That's it. That's what you want. So there we go. First Herbie built. Really, really pleased. Um, I had the forks already, so uh, I'm not quite sure what forks we'll spec on it if we do a complete. But it may well be Rockshock SIDS. Uh, these are 2021 SIDS, so they've got the um, the old manual cable lockout, which is fine. I prefer manual to electric myself. Um, it's all cabled gearing and so on. So proper, <laughs> could you believe it? Would you believe old school? But anyway, yeah, got it all built. Uh, I've gone to Sh Shimano gearing, Shimano XTR gearing, um, shifter and rear mech and cassette. Uh, cranks are Hope Carbon, chain ring Hope 36 ring. 36 tooth I believe I think uh, we'll check um, like I say internal cable routing um, the production frames will not have these little ports they will have because these are not guided internally this is I don't I didn't request these these are I don't know what happened there but um, it will come with as I said before it'll come with these ports you look different because these are guided inside there's a tube inside the frame so it'll all be guided there's no faffing around uh, this is literally put it in, it comes out the other end. This, headache. Um, not a fan of it at all, but it's my bike, so I'll have to put up with it. Uh, I've got the Smokestone SM35 rims, uh, carbon, made by Nexty. Uh, love these. Comes in whatever colour you want, so what we tend to do is match Hope colours to the stickers. So if you want orange, or that, this is actually the new bronze colour, but you'd never know. I must admit, I can't tell the difference between the bronze and the orange. Um, but anyway, looks really nice. Uh, I've gone for the full Hope kit. Everything, pedals, every single part on here is Hope that can be. Her Pro 5 hubs, X2 cross XC brakes. So they've got the X2, XC levers. Um, Say so Pro 5 and um, center lock rotors. Tires are Vittoria Peotti 2.4s. These are the cross country race tires. Um, yeah, 29 by 2.4 XC race tires. Super quick. Uh, slight, a big, I like big tires, so I went for those. And I wanted something fast. Seat clamp. There is a new seat clamp out now, which I, I missed out on. I ordered these, and then the next, next day almost, the new seat clamp came out, but it's fine. Um, same with uh, top cap. There's a new top cap as well now, but. This is all fine. So I've got Hope headset, like I said before, IS42, IS52 headset. The stem is the Hope cross country, 70 mil in this case. I've gone for Renthal fat bike light carbon bars, just because I had some. Um, you could go for Hope bars. I probably would put Hope bars on if I was uh, building this again, but I had those bars, so it seems silly to um, buy more. Like I say, XCR brakes, carbon levers, lovely brake levers these. I've not tried these before and I sort of prefer them to these, uh, the Tech 4s. These are really nice. Um, how robust they are, I'm not sure, because they're made for cross-country racing, so a lot, everything is in aluminium and um, really nice in carbon, but they're beautiful for this bike. Uh, as I mentioned already, uh, SID Ultimate Forks, 100 mil travel, I seem to remember. Pretty sure they are. Yeah, 100 mil, 100 mil travel. This bike will take 100 or 120, this frame. Got the new Smokestone logo on the head tube. It's the old the old logo from years ago, which I've re-bought. So that's on the new frames now. Um, what else? I think that's everything. I've got an old saddle. 
<laughs> uh, we sell this seat post. This is the um, Posty, uh, Smokestone Posty tie seat post. I haven't gone for a dropper. I wanted to build this bike uh, for cross country thrashing around. Maybe a bit of bike packing. We don't know yet. We'll see. I have got a kit I can put on here that's a bit lighter than normal just for sort of, if I want to do a quick quick um, almost race cross country i have got pannier racks as well should you want to go pannier mounts i should say should i want to fit a pannier on the back I, I didn't intend to have this for bike packing but i've got it so it seems silly to buy it and not have it suitable or be able to um go bike packing with it it's got all the mounts as i said in my previous video about the frame anything mounts underneath two box cage mounts inside so there you have it, titanium, low, long. The geometry is all on the website now. If you want to go on there, smokestonebikes.co.uk. Uh, the website is up to date. And um, there we go. Next thing is to ride it. So um, the new Smokestone Herbie. <laughs>